Uh, Bruce from Safari, and you saw our Jupiter wall kit the other day. Today we're going to do a complete walkthrough on StarTouch. Just before I do that, I'm just going to show you how we've got the wiring running here. So these are the lights coming in, and you can see here the positive comes in on the this side, and the negatives come in on the bottom. And we've got an RGBW light here, and on the RGBW you're switching on the negatives. So the, the control wires for the light go out here, we've got the positive coming in on this bridge here. So we've got in here a star light, star power. I've just got it uh, set up here for the demo. And we've got the star touch at the bottom here. And I'm now going to go to the fixed camera and uh, zoom in and show the rest. Okay, so let's have a look at our star touch. And this is wireless, and I'm just going to lift it off here. And it has a uh, base with uh, 12 volt going into a magnetic uh, base here. And the magnetic pins, you can see the pins there. And once it locks into the base there, uh, you'll see that that will boot up very quickly. The logo back here is changeable. Uh, we put it on an SD card. So you can have uh, any logo you like there, providing we want it to be a wireframe to get the same look and feel, but you can have your branding there. It stays on the SD card that will pop up every time. And we're just going to go through the bottom buttons here. We've got uh, the home, we've got lights, we've got power. Comfort we're not using right now, but we'll come back to that. We've got tanks, we've got a star tank connected, we've got monitoring, we're hooked up to the Victron Turbo. Battery percentage is shown on the top here. You can have, uh, I think, any number of temperatures here, and they rotate through. So you get cabin, fridge. Uh, the logic here is these temperatures don't change very much, so rotating them through here is uh, fine. So now we go back to the lights, and uh, we're just going to turn on the first light that we've got here which is on the left hand side there, you'll see that the dimmer appears up here so I can dim that up and down by uh, having my finger on the slide and I'm going to do the second light, it's quite bright so let's dim that down a bit and we can just dim that um, on and off. Now we've got those lights are being controlled by uh, the star power we've got the star light up here at the top and we've put uh, these two on star light so there's the white light. Again, uh, we can dim this up and down. You can see it's dimming there. But now we come to something that's uh, very hard for anyone else to do, and that is the RGBW, and I've chosen my favourite colour here, uh, pink. So, or salmon, I should say, for boys, pink for girls. And so now we turn that down. You can see we can dim it. And uh, you can set the colour for that on the smartphone app. We don't have it on this screen yet to change the colour. We will have, but at the moment it's uh, changing on the smartphone app. They're the lights that we've got there. I've programmed the interior mode here, so we've got some modes here. I've t programmed the interior mode to turn two lights on to do the salmon one inside and uh, that white and blue one outside that you can see there. And so you can program the modes arrive, depart, interior, exterior, uh, to be anything you like using the settings here and we go to the device settings here and you can see the matrix here that you've got of uh, different buttons then I set what uh, channels I want to come on when I hit mode interior it doesn't have to be lights it can be devices now the beauty of this system is that's wireless and so are these switches let's say this is inside the caravan it's on the wall and I press this uh, the light comes on, you'll see it on the screen here at the same time, I can turn it off. Turn the other light on, it comes on. And then we've also got programmed in here the RGBW coming on. So you can have up to six buttons assigned to the same channel. And you can turn on and off outside lights from either the touch screen or from the wireless keypad. Have a look at the tanks here for a minute. These are coming in from our star tank. They're wireless, they're battery, uh, they're Bluetooth very easy to set up. In the monitoring here we see the battery percentage, the voltage, we see the solar yield uh, go in and turn the inverter on and off, change the AC current input limit. Then we've got one other feature here that is let's take it off the 12 volt here for example and we want to put it inside in the vehicle then we connect in the back here and I've got this connected up to a battery pack here I'm on the USB and now I can go onto the USB here now and uh, turn that on and off in the back here. Uh, turn these lights on and off and uh, nothing's lost out of memory. And that's simply a matter of connecting the magnetic uh, connector here at the back into the USB. So if that is on a mount near the front of your dash, 
you can see exactly what the charging is you can control all the lights in the back of the van and then when you arrive you just take it off the front of the vehicle put it in the back of the van touch it or you can have these on the sun visor and turn the rear lights on when you're reversing at night or the side lights or the awning lights or the step lights until you get inside the van and then inside the van you can do the touch display it's entirely up to you so we will have this whole system running in a live demo for everyone to come and touch and feel at the uh, Melbourne Caravan and Camping Show uh, from the uh, 19th of February. We're on stand 213C. Come and see Tom and myself. How good's that?